What is up guys, VSN Kenny here, and today I have a little bit of World at War Zombies for you on a modded map called Pirate Ship. Now, this map is one of the most common modded maps that I've seen, so I'm sure you've probably heard of it if you've ever watched anything about modded zombies. But um, I'm basically just going to be doing a little playthrough just to get this series started, because I'm going to start doing a lot of reviews of modded maps for this game, because it's pretty fun to play them, and I think it's interesting to watch for you guys and I'm hoping that you'll like it and uh, basically I'm just gonna play through this map a little bit figure out what's going on this was the second time that I had ever played this map and uh, yeah so one of the first things I noticed was this uh, weird red wood that's lining all these little areas right here I was kind of confused by that because it's just it looks really weird so um I run up here and then I see that Juggernaut is right there. It's really easy to find. Um, and then I turned around here in a second and the MP40 was right there on the wall, which made me right off the bat kind of think that this map was going to be really easy because you could get an MP40 like right off the start. So, yeah, it ended up being really easy. So I was right. But uh, I run over there and get the MP40 here in a little bit and then it just becomes really boring I guess because well like I was saying it gets really really easy and that's the one thing that I have to say about this map it's too easy it just gets way too boring um, it's a pretty small map I mean there's not much to do it's hard to make a, like a big modded map obviously but uh, it's a alright size it's not too small but it's not too big either and uh, right there I just get the mp40 Oh, I looked in here, I was like, why do they need such a big area to spawn? <laughs> not sure why, um, they need like a huge room just for a spawn area. But anyway, um, most of these commentaries, I think I'm going to start doing them live. It's just, I recorded this late last night, um, so I didn't want to be like making a lot of noise in our room doing a commentary while my parents were asleep. So, yeah. Hopefully from now on they'll be live, which will be a bit more interesting because right now I really don't have that much to talk about other than a little bit of what's going on in the game. But right now I'm just kind of staying in the same area shooting some zombies, so there's not much to talk about. Um, so yeah, over there is some more guns that are like right near the start. And then if you open up this right here, the box is over there, which is just... I don't know, it's way too easy to get to in my opinion. It makes it really easy. And then um, there's one other thing that I'll show you in a little bit that makes this map way too easy. And it's basically that there's a catwalk up there that the um, zombies don't spawn underneath you and you can just sit there and camp it. But um, yeah, it gets, it gets kind of boring. <laughs> um, there's double tap over there as you just saw. Quick revive was by the spawn. And Juggernog, you saw that, which I will be getting here in a little bit. And uh, Speed Coal is over there by the box. And Power is also over by the box. Um, you can't go underneath the ship, which is kind of disappointing. I was hoping you could like go down underneath and um, into the whatever you call it. But yeah, underneath the ship. But you can't. It is pretty cool that you can jump down from where I just did a little bit ago, up there uh, from the top down to the bottom. See, there's Speed Cola, and there's the box. Oh, and I thought this this uh, little statue right here was really weird. It's like a horse with no head. I'm not really sure what's up with that. He's like walking the line. I don't, I don't even know. <laughs> it's really confusing. And there's a full moon. Well, you, can, you can't really see the bottom of it because of the water, but... I'm assuming it's full. Right here, I was like, oh, dual bow bowie knives. Awesome. But you, could, um, you can't get dual. It's just dual on the wall, and then you get it, and there's one, which is stupid. So, yeah, I think I'm about to go up to the catwalk that I was talking about that makes this map extremely easy. And you'll see what I'm talking about, because it's really dumb. Um... Yeah, I think I'm gonna go use the box. Oh no, actually, I'm saving up for Juggernaut right now, and then I go use the box after that. So, let me just fast forward a little bit.
Alright, so I'm about to get Jug, and then I'm gonna go, um, use the box. Alright, so I got 950, and now I'm gonna go use the box, and then go up to the catwalk and show you exactly what I was talking about, how it makes this map extremely easy. Yep, over here is the catwalk, and once you go over here, um, you can't fall off the edge, which makes it even easier, except for that point right there. Um, I actually ended up doing something really stupid because I didn't know you could fall off of that um, the first time that I played this map, and I was just like trying to like play around because I was like, oh, you can't fall off. So I was just like jumping around, pretending like I was trying to jump off the edge, and then I jumped off over there and like fell down to the ground and killed myself. I might actually end up posting that because it was pretty funny. But I'm not sure because it's kind of stupid, but it was funny. It was even funny just like playing by myself, so maybe it'll be funny for a video. We'll see. But yeah, the zombies don't come from anywhere except for right there where I'm shooting right now. And that's just like... It's like one of the dumbest things I've ever seen. They should at least like climb up from somewhere else. I don't know. I mean, I guess that would be really hard to make them climb and stuff in a modded map. But still, if uh, if he doesn't have the ability to make them climb like that, he shouldn't have made this big of a catwalk. See, I'm just camping here and can do whatever I want. Just back up. Once they get up on me, then just pop them in the head. But yeah, that's um, that's basically this map. You've seen about everything. It's a pretty small map, but it is neat. I like the looks of it but it's not very good to play it just gets boring because if you die on this map really you must suck unless it's maybe the first two rounds first two or three rounds but once you get jug you should not die on this map it's way too easy um so yeah i'm probably just gonna let you guys watch a little bit more of this gameplay i'll probably cut it off around round 15 or something because it'll just be stupid to play any more than that but um yeah have some fun watching this and thank you guys for watching and please subscribe Boiling freak bag brains coming up. I told you I wasn't on the menu.
nothing like bad habits. See you, maggot bag. Rah, devil man. Double points. Get so... Drop 
Tripping like bad habits. Not even close. Free bag. Need it. Free bag. KIA maggot sack. Don't fuck with a marine. Shouldn't these guys be on a leash? Appreciate it. 